Hi everyone, this is Mark Moykins from Big Mountain Studio, and I'm here to share another storyboard tip with you for this week. And it might be something you already know, but I just want to cover it just to make sure that you guys know it. And basically, what it comes down to is, how do you change many things at one time? Like, you need to do a big refactoring on your storyboard. And I know some people have complained about this with storyboards, is it's difficult to make sweeping changes. Well, the biggest tip that I can help you out with and let you know about is you can select multiple objects and change things all at once like this so these are all just you know labels and you can change all the labels all at one time so if I need to change all of these colors well I can do that I can just come here and maybe I want it to be a lighter color or a darker color you know something like that let's change this back to white and there's a lot of other things that I can change uh, everything all at one time too and it's not just like controls you know labels and labels you notice I have here a UI image view and here I have a button and then here I have a a label well I can actually select all of those things and make changes to some of their properties because one thing every single control has in common that is on the your storyboard they all inherit from UI view which are these properties right here so you can change these properties and it'll affect everything that you have selected so I just want to kind of give you that tip that you can select multiple things and make changes all at once. You don't have to select one label, change the font, select another label, change the font. No, select everything all at once. Okay, this is a quick tip, probably something you already know, but I just felt like I had to come out with it just to make sure that you guys knew that you could do that. Multiple select items, whether they're the same or not, so you can change properties that they have in common. Thanks for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. And it's, I don't imagine I'll get too many likes in this video because it seems just too simple. <laughs> and so, so don't like it if you don't like it. But if, share it with your friends if you think they can use it. And consider subscribing because I'll be coming out with more storyboard tips. Hopefully, you know, better than this. But this is a tip and I did want to share it. Okay, thank you.